Hi guys, in today's video I'm going to be showing you how to install Home Assistant OS on a Dell Wise 3040. So what you're going to need is a Dell Wise 3040 of course, a keyboard and mouse, monitor, wired Ethernet internet connection, a 4 to 8 gigabyte USB stick, a very fast 8 gigabyte or more USB stick. So next, you're just going to want to go to Chrome and then you're going to want to type in Linux Mint old versions. Then you're going to want to select 20.1 Cinnamon. Then let it download. Next, you're going to want to go to Google and then type in Home Assistant Download. Next, scroll down until you see x86 to 64 systems. Then click on Instructions. Then scroll all the way down to Step 5 where you can click on the Download. Next, open up the file. Then, once you've opened it up, you're going to want to click on Flash with File. Then, once you've clicked on that, you're going to want to double click the Linux Mint ISO. Then, you're going to want to select your 8GB or above fast USB. Then, you're going to want to click Flash. After that's done, you're going to want to flash the other USB stick, which is uh, 4 to 8 gigabytes with Home Assistant OS. So you're just going to want to select the file, which is the Home Assistant file we downloaded earlier. Then you're going to select the device, which is the uh, 4 to 8 gigabyte USB disk. Then you're going to want to click flash. Once that's done, you're going to want to turn on your Dell and then spam F2 till you get into the BIOS. Unlock the BIOS if you have to. Next, go into boot devices and then set the Linux Mint boot device to the top. Then, let it boot from Linux Mint. And then click on the top option. After that's done, Go into the Linux Mint and then install Berlin Etcher from GitHub. Go to the releases GitHub page and then install Berlin Etcher from the GitHub site. Next, open up Berlin Etcher. clone from the uh, Home Assistant uh, USB to the EMMC storage in the next option. Next, you're going to want to turn off your Dell Ys and then unplug every single USB. And sometimes you have to unplug it from the back because it just fails. Then turn on your Dell until it reaches the Home Assistant OS screen. Now you've successfully installed Home Assistant OS on a Dell Wise 3040. Thank you guys for watching. Please like and subscribe and I'll see you in the next one.